All right, guys, welcome back to another video. It is Josh. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can edit the best possible TikTok. This is the same method that I use for all of my TikToks. So trust me, if you duplicate this, you are going to be in for some success at least. So make sure to stick around for the entire video if you want to actually learn how I edit my own TikToks and how you can edit them yourself. But quickly, before I get into it, make sure to like, comment, subscribe if you guys do enjoy or you learn something. And with all that out of the way, let's get right into it. All right, so instead of playing you guys and just showing you the final product that I actually use to apply the final edit, editing touches to. I thought I would show you this part of the process, which is actually going to be my cutting and stock footage portion. If you guys don't know, I do my editing in two different softwares. I do all my cutting and all that on DaVinci, and then I'll take the cut up version with my overlay of my webcam, the stock footage. I'll take it over to After Effects. I'll add my subtitles as well as the other effects to actually perfect it. But yeah, I'll quickly show you guys. Pretty much all I do is I just have my webcam right here that I record separately, and I just have my audio for that, and I have it cut up with the portion we can see at the very top. So if we disable this, this this is literally all it is. It's just my webcam at the very top of the screen. Me talking. I have it cut down into the portions where I don't have any gaps left out whatsoever. And then what I do is I figure out what I'm saying and I'll just add a little thing of stock footage underneath it. It's super, super simple. And I'll just do that for the entire thing. I'll render this out and then I will take it to After Effects for subtitling, which is what I'm going to be highlighting in a second. If you guys want to actually skip to that, I'll have a timestamp in the description for that. But all I got to do, we can see this is even zooming a bit. This is the only effect I add inside of DaVinci and that's just the blur mill curves to this layer. And I'll start it at one and I'll end the layer at 0.9. It's that simple. I'll literally have these small little zooms and that's that's really all it is. It's, it's nothing complicated. I'll take this, I'll render it out and I'll take it to After Effects, like I said, to do subtitling. So let's actually hop on over to after effects so i can show you guys what i actually do once this is all done so i'm actually going to show you guys this in a brand new project so we're going to make sure the resolution is good so for tiktok it's 1080 by 1920 if you guys don't know i'm just going to change the duration to 16 seconds and i'm going to name this uh worst setup i believe okay now i found it so this is actually right here we can see this is what it looks like cut up we got the stock footage with the zooming and it's super simple and i'll just subtitle every single word that i hear so for example this youtuber has blah 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 and i'll add markers all the way along just like this and obviously i will also adjust the composition length by copying this at the very end of the last frame going up here to composition settings pacing in the duration that'll auto adjust it pretty much all we have is we have this right here all of our markers for each individual word what i'll do from there is i'll click anywhere on the screen here i believe the first word is this or no it's which sorry which youtuber has the best so pretty much that i'll center it just like this i'll press position P, if you guys don't know, drag it down here to the middle of this actual stock footage portion. And then from there, I will actually come here to character. These are my subtitle settings, 175 pixel, Mont, heavy demo. Uh, I'll show you the color code for the yellow that I use, F9, FF48, in case you were curious about that for some reason. Um, and then I'll click on the layer here, go to animation, and then I'll just add the shorts preset, which is the drop shadow. These are the drop shadow settings here. If you wanna look at it for some reason. And then what I'll do is I'll come along every single marker and I'll press Control Shift D to actually cut the clip or the subtitle layer, I should say. So it literally will look like this. And then I'll come through and I'll edit what it says. So this YouTuber or which YouTuber has the worst, just like this, setup, something like that. It's not exact, obviously, but we can see. Which YouTuber has the worst setup? I made a ton of It's delayed, but it, you, it's just to give you guys an idea of how it actually works. And then I'll come through here, each layer, click on the layer, add the subtitle preset. I'll adjust these two to the very middle of each word. So for example, this, I don't know why that adjusted. Which YouTuber. And then I'll just literally, this one needs to, these two need to come a bit over. Copy it, paste it onto this, and then to view the keyframes, I just press U. And I literally just do that for every single word. It's very tedious, I know, trust me. I do it almost every single day when I'm editing my TikToks. And eventually, I'll literally, it'll just look like this. YouTuber has the worst setup? I made a ton of you can see the animation just looks like that. It's super basic, uh, copy paste it onto every single subtitle. But trust me, once you have this method down, you're guaranteed success on TikTok. Trust me, for some reason, this format of video works. Um, I wasn't expecting my content to work when I was posting this kind of stuff, but it does. So that's pretty much that. Um, but yeah, that is how you actually edit your very own TikToks. All you would do, you'd go through all your subtitles. Obviously, you're going to have a lot more layers than only 19 
words in your entire TikTok. This probably has, I'll actually show you guys what the project looks like for it. I'll quickly show you. This is like an example of one of my TikToks and this is before I was using the animations. So that's how, that's how many sub, I have 67 subtitle layers here and we can see coming through like it's just, there are so many different ones. And then I have my song overlaid. I use the song Aces. It's copyrighted. I'm not going to be playing it because obviously it'll cause my video to get copyright claimed. I don't want that necessarily. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much a sample of what a project looks like realistically. So uh, don't be expecting those super big subtitle layers because if you're doing single words, you're definitely going to have a lot more. We can see even the markers along here at the top. That's what it looks like. But yeah, this is one of the TikTok projects that I had and I'm pretty sure that video did pretty well. Uh, I can't remember off the top of my head how many views that had, but if you guys did enjoy, uh, presets in the description, 100% free. Like I said, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, like I mentioned earlier in the video. And as always, I will see you guys in a future video on the channel. Hope you guys did have lots of fun, maybe following along with this. If you didn't, I don't know what to tell you, but I will see you guys in a future video on the channel. Peace out.